morning guys and welcome to Bournemouth. So we are staying in these beautiful little Bournemouth beach lodges which I absolutely love. I'm going to show you around inside in a sec but basically we're here for the whole weekend. It took us about two and a half hours to drive down from London um, and we're going to be doing loads and loads of fun stuff so you have to come with me. Firstly we're going to be going to Durdledore which is one of the most beautiful kind of national trust uh, parks in the in well it's actually in Dorset but it's about an hour away from here um, we're also going to be doing some paddle boarding we're going to be trying some of the best fish and seafood restaurants in town and uh, and then we're going to be swimming in this ah, it looks a little bit cold but I think it's going to be fine um so come with so you come in we've got little sofas tv and two beds downstairs well there's sofas at the moment but they turn into beds later sent us this gorgeous goodie bag goodie box full of yummy treats got a little bathroom there which is a bit dark can't see i'll show you in the daylight then a full kitchen a sink cooker and then if you come upstairs see the view out there it's lovely cutest little steps and then we've got one bed over there for a single and then the double here and little wardrobes, little covered space wardrobes. So cute. So we've just arrived at Durdledorf, which you can see behind me there. This is one of the most famous and epic spots on the Jurassic Coast. It's where everybody comes to visit. We drove for about an hour. It took us an hour from Bournemouth to get here. But if you come in from London, it's about two and a half, two hours, 40 minutes. You just park at the top um, and you can pay the parking for the rest of the day and then do beautiful coastal walks along the coast. It's so spectacular. So I'm going to show you around a bit. But it's totally worth it because check out how beautiful that sunset is behind us. So pretty. And Jay is on the drone. So that's going up. And then Sabrina's getting hers too. So it's like drone city today. Good morning, guys. So today we are off surfing and actually the weather looks a little bit calm, which means we'll probably end up doing SUP, which is stand-up paddle boarding. But we're on our way and we're going on these super cute little barrel bikes, which um, actually the guys from Bournemouth Council gave us with the lodges. So you can actually ride around and the promenade is really smooth and straight and easy. So it's a really quick, easy way to get around. Go in. So we just get fitted up with the wetsuits here 
and then they give us a surfboard each um, and a paddle and we're basically going to be paddling for about two hours uh, which is really fun we'll go on a little journey around the coast has given me a physical challenge mm -hmm. by the and mental today, actually. and mental what are we gonna yeah. do yeah we're gonna go for a swim in the atlantic ocean yes in we are pretty much winter we're going into that and it's october so i mean i think it could be fun mm -hmm. yeah let's absolutely. do this let's do this baby yeah <laughs> Now we're totally energised and it's fabulous. <laughs> We're going for a little walk along the beach. And where are we off to, kids? Urban Reef. In fact, it's right there, babe. Oh, look. There we go. Fairy light. That is our fairy lit dinner tonight. So it's bye bye from Bournemouth. Um, we have literally had the most lovely time. Um, to say it's only like a couple of hours out of London, uh, it just feels like a world away. We spent so much time by the beach. Uh, I think my favourite thing was heading out to Durdle Door, which was so beautiful in the sunshine. Um, and also, oh, and also the freezing cold swim yesterday, which Sabrina uh, dared me to do. Um, but also the food's been amazing. It's just been a really brilliant staycation, um, especially staying in these little beach huts. They're super, super cute. And um, they're really perfect for uh, just like a little small family unit or a little gang like we were. Uh, but it's been such a lovely time. So thanks to Bournemouth Beach Lodges. I'm actually gonna put a little link below so you can check it out yourself. And uh, see you later, Bournemouth. 